Now, what we often hear from left wing activists on this issue is there's simply a failure of empathy on the part of people who believe the federal government should have any oversight over who's crossing the border or that Border Patrol should be able to do its job in securing our border. Of course, the irony is they're totally incapable of being compassionate towards people who live in border states and actually have to wrestle with the struggles of unfettered migration. You know, look, it's actually an area for national unity that I see here. So I ended up visiting uh, now a couple months ago. Now I visited the south side of Chicago. Not a which tra- part? I went to South Shore. Okay, went cool, to cool. other parts He's of the from South Chicago. Side. Yeah, oh, really? Chicago originally, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. South Shore High School hmm. right now is being converted into an encampment for migrants. Yeah. Actually, by the way, seven thousand dollars per person per month is roughly what that costs. But that's like ninety thousand a year, by yeah, the way. I mean, that's exactly that's, if you were if you were making ninety k a year and spending all of it uh, each month without saving anything, that's and not paying your taxes. Like that's how much it is untaxed, right? Because yeah, these, are, yeah. these are illegal migrants yeah, by yeah. definition. And so people in that town, and by the way, this is far left, supposedly far left territory, hard democratic stronghold, not a place where Republican politicians go. Frankly, not even a place where many Democrat politicians go who were probably more strongly in favor of closing the border than even many traditional Republican donors Mm. who I meet with on a given basis. And that's interesting to me because that's that's an America first principle, right? It doesn't fit in the Democratic or Republican boundaries, but they're asking a legitimate question, which goes back to that earlier conversation we were having. Why are we taking care of somebody else first instead of starting right here at home. Yep. And so their question was, look, I had trouble getting baby formula or sneakers. You've got sneakers and baby formula for people who are showing up illegally into this country, breaking the law. They're getting seven thousand dollar checks. What am I getting? Which I think is not an unreasonable question to ask. And so anyway, this issue around border security. I think there is far more consensus in this country across traditional boundaries than the media would have you believe. Traditional mm. media would have you believe, certainly. I think that most Americans who I've met support the idea that I've advanced, which is that building the wall isn't enough. I mean, look, you want to talk about how fentanyl gets into this country. There's cartel financed tunnels underneath those walls now. Much of what people think they're buying is Percocet or weed or whatever is often even laced now with fentanyl. But the way we solve that problem and the migrant crisis along with it is use our military to secure that southern border. We're now using our military equipment and resources to secure somebody else's border halfway around the world. Let's use our own military to secure our own southern border. I think we do it for our northern border, too. That's how you address the actual crisis. And I think that there's broad consensus around that because just walk down the list. Do you believe that nations should have borders? Some people haven't. It's not a nation without borders. It's not a nation without borders. That's certainly my belief. But there are certain people who will say we shouldn't have borders and whatever. Okay, fine. Let's smoke that out and get that on the table. But that's a tiny fringe minority of people. Yeah. Most people in this country say they want borders. But then if you want borders, then, okay, if you believe in a border, then have a border. Yep. And if we can't use our own military to secure our own border, that means we don't believe in the existence of the importance of that border in the first place, yep. which is why I said I would close that loop. 